Because at next you... You're going to eat what I cook you, you know. <laughs> Imagine that with spaghetti. <laughs> <laughs> so, we're going to grate the cheese. That smells it. insanely good. You're not going to hear this because it's just it's really an annoying sound. So we're going to play some nice music under this. Here we go. Ready? A one and a two and a three and... Some beautiful music. I don't know. We haven't chose it yet because we haven't hit post production. But uh, here's our cheese. Look at how beautiful it oh, is. Now it's notice how this is not white cheese. It's golden. Golden. This is the Cadillac of Italian cheeses. So guys, again, no substitutes. You don't want, you know, craft in the green can Parmesan cheese. You're gonna destroy this. We, the ingredients are everything. It's very simple. It's a simple dish. It's all dependent on how it's put together and the ingredients that you use. Yes. So, Parmigiano Reggiano cheese. No substitutes, please. Okay. <laughs> nice poetry there, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> eight eggs. I'm going to use four yolks and eight whites. And then we're, when I get them all together, I'll whip them up and put them in the oven to warm them up. Beautiful. There we go. All right. Look at that egg yolk. I'm going to save that one. Okay. Ah, this is a baby one. Get rid of that. <laughs> Pop says goodbye to every, every little chicken yolk. embryo <laughs> that goes goes down the tube. So long. He gives him a little burial at sea. So long, you long. <laughs> oh, I love my eggs. Mm -hmm. Ooh, nice. Good looking egg. Yeah, these are good eggs. Okay. Uh, all right, here we go. So now, you got all the eggs whipped up, right? Yeah. So okay, what do we do? We're going to put them in the oven at a temperature of 140 degrees. 140 degrees, we don't want to end up with scrambled eggs, we just want to warm them up. them up. And then, one of the ideas to keep this a hot dish is to put your dishes in the eggs in a 140 degree uh, temperature oven. So you want, to, you want to have everything warm. This dish gets cold fast. Once we whip it up, we're going to immediately serve it. Well, you'll see why it cools off, because <laughs> it has to cool off, otherwise you're... Uh, Parmigiana Reggiana will string. It'll be it'll, it'll string out like mozzarella. You we know? don't want that. And your eggs will turn into scrambled eggs, eggs and you don't want that. Either. that. Salud. Salud. When you go to buy spaghetti, don't think that all spaghettis are the same. They're not. All spaghettis are not created equal. So Absolutely. This is Wegman's Italian classic. It's a uh, red, it's green and and it's uh, it's sort of amber, but they have one of the finest uh, imported Italian private label pastas in the United States. So we're using Wegman's Italian classic. And this is bronze dye. Oh, okay. beautiful. Great. Okay, first you got to have the salt that's blessed by the rabbi, right? Yeah. Let's buy the rabbi the and, and of course Rocco too. Yeah, yeah. All right. Rocco. Rocco's already in on the on, on commercializing himself. One handful, two handful. Uh, that's enough. That's enough? That's enough. You sure? Yeah. A little more. Just a touch. You want? 
Just a touch. <laughs> Thank you. Bye. All right. We're going to make sure we got a rapidly boiling pot. Because pasta doesn't like to be put in unboiling water. Yeah, yeah. There it goes. You don't time pasta because each pasta cooks at a different time based on the thickness of the wall of the pasta. And, and how it's made. Ooh. Yeah. All right. <laughs> So let's let's recount here. We put a little oil in the pot, yeah. in the pan, the bacon pan, because the pasta is going to go there. That's going to keep the pasta separated. Separated and loose. Okay. We've got all our ingredients at the ready. And again, folks, this is really simple. We got the the eggs. They're warmed to 140 degrees. We got the cheese. We got the bacon. We got the pepper. We got the parsley. That's it. <music> Usually when you shake all the water out of the pasta, we're not going to do that this time. Why, Pop? Because we want some of the moisture. Quick, George. Just dump it. Hey, he's done dumping. Yeah, we're going to get rid of all the water. All right, there you go. Beautiful. All right. So a little bit of the pasta water in with the pasta, in other words. And the oil. The idea of the oil is to mix it up. You'll see how it's starting to glisten already. Mm. And now... We want to keep that that way and we're almost ready for the eggs. Okay. Oh, there comes the eggs. There comes the eggs. Beautiful. Pepper, George. Pepper. So we do a little pepper. Oh, look how beautiful that looks. Already. Here we go. Okay, good enough. Okay, uh, throw the bacon on, please, George. You got it, primo. It's a bacon. Got a pound of pasta, a pound of bacon. All right, let's see. We're about ready. Go ahead. Okay, how do you want this done? Just dump round and round and round. All right, you keep going. This is nice with four hands. It's easier, to, it's more fun to do it with a partner than by yourself. Yeah. We're putting on the Parmesan the Reggiana. Reggiana. <laughs> this is our cream. All right. All right. So last step. Oh, look how beautiful that is. Mm. Is that good? Yeah. A little more. A little, a little more. more? Yeah, a little more. Right. Wow. Beautiful. Okay. And with the old spaghetti fork, there it comes. Man, my mouth is watering. You know. Okay. There That's you go. Good. That's for Mama? Yeah. Spaghetti alla carbonara. Nothing better. Nothing better. That's for me because I have a healthy that. appetite. Ah, lots of bacon. Yeah. <laughs> We test the test of time and the test of nature all put together in a little dish. Ah, how good is that? <laughs> okay, so remember, folks, when you come to Nick's, you eat what I cook you. That's right. <laughs> God bless you. God bless baby Jesus. Yeah.